Hey y'all, it's Mommy Wata and I am back. Fire signs. We gonna go with it. <laughs> I didn't even get to say my little intro, but y'all already know, thank you so much for your support of My Right Botanicals. And let's see what oracle messages we have for my fire sign. Leo, Aries, Sagittarius. Let's see what the Holy Spirit wants you all to know at this time messages from you through me please and thank you holy spirit <clears throat> what would you like for the fire sign collective to know holy spirit what are the messages for them at this time aries leo sagittarius Sagittarius, <clears throat> Leo, and Aries, Holy Spirit. What would you like for them to know, please and thank you, at this time, from you, through me, Holy Spirit, Oracle Messages, for my Fire Sign Collective. <clears throat> I'm not sure why my voice is doing this. Maybe there's some throat chakra issues going on with you all. Fire Signs, let's see here. Karmic Energy, right out the gate. So there's a karmic energy associated with this fire sign vibe we got going on here. Uncle Sam. Do my yoga, drink my water, mind my business. Somebody lying, sexual abuse was trying to come out. What else, Holy Spirit? Can we get some clarity from my fire signs? A bank statement doesn't measure your blessings. Okay, so I'm going to tell y'all right out the gate. Somebody has reported you to the IRS. Somebody has tried to say that you are making money, possibly hiding income somewhere. Okay? And they tried to report you some, for some sort of tax fraud here. But what's happening here is that Uncle Sam has investigated you, fire sign, okay? And all they've come up, all they've come to find out about you is that you are handling your business, okay? They may have even been monitoring you, monitoring your bank accounts. This, whatever this person said that you have, whatever money they think that you got put up or hidden somewhere, Uncle Sam didn't find that money, okay? Because you don't have this hidden fraudulent income that this karmic energy accused you of having. They're just jealous, <clears throat> okay? Because they ass probably ain't got nothing, can't build or acquire nothing, and you have built and acquired something for yourself. But it's not anything fraudulent. It's not anything that you're hiding. Any income that you're receiving, the IRS know about every damn penny. Know that. And you do. Because you ain't even on no shit like that. But this karmic tried to get you in trouble with the IRS with Uncle Sam. Okay? And it, it, did, it didn't go how they hoped it would. What else, Holy Spirit, from my fire signs, please, and thank you. The resurrection. These people really dug into your past financially. I don't know what kind of allegations this karmic made against you, but these people really dug into your financial past, okay? But you're doing what you're supposed to do. If you are making a considerable amount of money, you've reported that shit, and you're paying whatever you need to pay Uncle Sam. Okay, see, this karmic energy don't know that part, but that's what I'm hearing. What else, Holy Spirit? And then we gonna go to the tarot, y'all. Anything else here? Snake. Because that's what they tried to do. They tried to do some old snake-ass shit. 444 that you were spiritually protected from. Okay? This person may have even tried to resurrect something from your past to try to prove that you had 
some illegal dealings. And now they regret everything they said about you. Forgive me. Okay? That's their vibe right now because they're making false reports to the IRS. The IRS might have decided to look into their damn ass. Facade, don't be fooled. Because they thought they was going to fool Uncle Sam about you. I have got to pull that card because that's exactly what they thought. They thought they was going to fool the government. <coughs> This karmic did. That's some old karmic ass shit. They thought they was going to fool the government into believing that you was some money laundering, old, roguish fraud energy. Like Uncle Sam can't really get to digging if they don't want to. If they truly want to, they can get to digging. Okay? And that, I feel like something happened. And they didn't got the digging in on this karmic. At, look, cut the deck on the Queen of Pentacles in reverse. I'm about to fix that. Ten of Swords right behind that. They didn't realize something about this energy. This person probably got to pay Uncle Sam some money for some shit they damn did. Why they trying to tell on you? They should have made sure that they swept around their own front door first. That's what I'm hearing. So what else, Holy Spirit, for my fire signs, Leo, Aries, Sagittarius, what else would you like for them to know at this time? Let's do one more shuffle, y'all. Wow. <clears throat> and I'm also hearing that you actually might be looking like you're struggling a little bit. Like you you can pay your bills. You can do some of the things you want to do. But you ain't got no whole bunch of money sitting up in the bank. You, you got a few dollars, maybe. That's what I'm hearing. Off this, a bank statement doesn't measure your blessings, okay? Which is all right. Because some people don't even have the money to pay their bills. Let alone have a few dollars left in an account after they pay them. So, you definitely are blessed. Page of Pentacles. But I'm telling you, these people look into your employment. They look into your money, your career, your education, your home. They look into all your shit. Any type of, anything that you do business around financially, they looked into that shit. I'm telling you, this person told a whopper here. What did this karmic energy say exactly, Holy Spirit? Like, this person had to accuse you of something major for the level of investigation I'm picking up on. Clarify, Holy Spirit. But your ducks is in a row. The devil that came out here with the five of swords. Like I said, they, they used some sort of manipulative vice to cause some sort of misrepresentation about who you are. They were very cunning, but they're also defeated. They're also humiliated, frustrated, because even if they were able to get you in some sort of trouble or cause you to have to pay back some taxes or something, it's a pointless victory. That ain't going to stop whatever you're doing to generate income because this is why this person is mad. I mean, the scales is still being bounced in your favor. It would have been bounced in your favor either way. Because, I, look, I'm telling you, she tried to do this thinking that it was going to hurt your abundance, but your cup is still going to continue to overflow. And, again, you don't, you don't have to pay them people nothing. Because, baby, I promise you, this high for energy is Uncle Sam, okay? <laughs> and with this emperor right behind it, okay? I don't know who she reported you to, but they looked into your shit. Trust me. You ain't getting away with nothing. And I'm telling you, whoever I'm picking up on, you might be paying they ass already something or either you 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 ain't robbing peter to pay paul but you know you do all right but it ain't like nothing what this karmic was trying to say but you are in the nine of cups i'm telling you you're satisfied your bills are paid 
You do not have to scramble to take care of your business financially, 1001. But you ain't sitting on racks on top of racks on top of racks like this woman said you was. And I'm telling you, she said that you had money put up somewhere like offshore accounts or something. Just got a notification from the damn bank. I'm telling you, a up, she communicated something or said something like you had money put up in different locations outside of where you reside, outside of the country where you reside. These people really looked into you. High Priestess. You have no idea. This is completely unbeknownst to you. I'm hearing that. It was some mystery about how you made your money. I feel when they first started looking into you, investigating you. These people did question the source of your income. Not that you were actually making valid income, I'm hearing, but how you were making it. It was very mysterious to them, very interesting to them. Clarify what I'm picking up on, Holy Spirit. Lovers with the five of wands. These people felt conflicted about how you make your money. You may be some sort of something you do. I don't know what you do because I was just hearing a couple of things. But this, you know, you got to take what resonates and leave what does not. But this community was very conflicted about how you make your money. But they can't deny that you do have some sort of gift or talent or ability that you're chosen. Because I'm not hearing that it was necessarily that you were a spiritual advisor. But whatever you do, you have a very high level of passion and desire for it. It's obvious this is why you're able to be successful. So you could be an entrepreneur, okay, 1221. But it can't be denied that you are a boss, okay? That you use your creativity to generate material wealth for yourself. So again, they, they can't question the source of the income because it's a valid source of income. But they do have conflicting conflicting views on what it is that you do to make the money you make okay but they still can't lock you up for that because you're not doing anything illegal okay and you are paying your taxes straight like that that's what i'm hearing and now this karmic energy is in regret i regret everything i said about you because they asked and lost something them trying to come for you has sent up some sort of alarm or alert about them and their financial business. King of Pentacles right behind that. So this could be a masculine who was doing this. And the Holy Spirit says that's the truth. Them, their attempt to have some sort of con, some sort of victory over you to create this conquest, this manhunt even because of your prosperity and success, has placed their ass under judgment. They weren't expecting this turning point. They weren't expecting, let me cover up the people on the bottom. They weren't expecting you to come out of this unscathed and for them to be on the chopping block. Because now, the I feel like Uncle Sam is questioning where they got their money from. Nine of Swords. Some, I'm telling you, somebody was like 14, 14. Well, let's look into this person and see if they're on the up and up since they're making such flagrant allegations against this divine feminine. So a masculine was out here hating on a fire sign energy because the fire sign energy is this empress here. Okay? You're coming out as a Taurus Libra vibe, but I feel like that's speaking to other aspects of your chart.
something to do with your Mars and your Saturn here. Your, your Libra could be in your Saturn planet. Something about responsibility and discipline. Your responsibility and your discipline has kept you out of some major trouble with the government, fire signs. And the person, I'm telling you, your, your creativity, your career driven, your swift action, you are highly motivated. Your ability to handle business, your ability to be responsible and disciplined because people don't usually think of a Knight of Wands as a disciplined person, but they are disciplined. They may be high spirited, but when they decide to go for something, when they decide to execute something or handle something, they gonna do that. They don't care who or what stops them. Highly driven, highly motivated, highly disciplined when it comes to executing something that they strongly believe in. And I feel like that's how you handle your business, fire signs. You stay on top of your shit. And, ooh, I can't make it up. Eight of Pentacles, Chariot. Very ambitious, very goal-oriented, very driven to be successful. So you're not going to do not try to do nothing outside of the right thing because you want to have positive results. You want to be successful. Okay? So this person don't know you if they thought that you was out here on some shit like that. They ass was on some snake shit like that. And I'm telling you, they're being investigated. They're under judgment. Six of Wands. Some sort of significant progress that they've had. Some sort of financial advancement that people are publicly aware of is being looked into by whoever this karmic energy is. They're this page of Pentacles devil. They this devil, five of swords, page of Pentacles, and this five of cups. This nine of swords energy. And they are being investigated. They, they are up under some sort of spotlight right now. And this person is going to be at the Ten of Wands in a minute. All these burdens that they were hoping, I'm telling you, they're being investigated. All of these burdens that they, all of these burdens that they were hoping to have placed at your front door is going to be right on their doorstep in a minute. And whoever I'm talking to, I'm telling you, you don't even know that these allegations were made against you. The, the Uncle Sam wasn't going to come to you with nothing until they were sure that what was being reported was accurate. But they did do an investigation, and this is what they found out. 1808, that your finances are, are in order. That you ain't out here scamming or scheming or hiding or doing nothing when it comes to money. 1818. Anything else for my fire signs, Holy Spirit? And I also feel like that's why y'all not really out here like that. Because you ain't got shit to do with this. This ain't got page of wands. This ain't got nothing to do with you. You ain't, you gonna receive good news from the universe. Queen of Wands then flew out here now. You are very independent of these allegations that were made against you. God kept this shit away from you. Because you are doing what you're supposed to do. You are a clear thinker. You down to earth. You, you're not going to be on no, let me try to get away with something outlandish and far-fetched vibe. That's not you. Okay? Anything else, Holy Spirit? You are this Empress energy and you're going to continue to celebrate because you do things by the book. You have been doing things the right way and handling your business because you've grown and it's going to continue to pay off for you. But this other person is in the Ten of Swords. Okay? They in the Ten of Swords. I, I really feel like it wasn't just this King of Pentacles. I'm going to clarify real quick for y'all before we close. Because I feel like this King of Pentacles had a partner in crime who 
Pope conspired with him to do this. That's what I was just seeing in that other deck. Let's we we finna clarify with this new deck here. Somebody he co-conspired with someone, this karmic king of pentacles to do this against you. Not thinking about the fact that he ain't on the up and up when it comes to how he obtained his money. How he's sitting in this king of pentacles energy. Flashing lights by Kanye West featuring Dwelle just came on. Because I'm telling you, him and whoever his, his partner in crime is, they've been being real flashy with it. Okay? And, and he wasn't thinking about that when he was caught himself trying to report you. So, Holy Spirit, what do we need to know about this King of Pentacles? Is he, does he have a partner in crime who influenced him to make these allegations against my fire signs? Holy Spirit, what do we need to know here before we close? Please and thank you, Holy Spirit. Let's see, y'all. Hangman. There was somebody chariot. Either a Pisces or a Cancer, a devil on the bottom, who this man had as a love choice, a karmic lover. This person has Pisces and Cancer in their chart. This man made a lot of money by taking some very destructive action with this karmic love choice here. They, they've done a lot of things, made a lot of sacrifices, were very ambitious themselves, but in the wrong way here. And they done got caught up with the government, with Uncle Sam, because something that they did in the past to have a Ten of Pentacles has been resurrected. Okay? While they was trying to get you in trouble. What else, Holy Spirit? Knight of Wands, something that they did, that they were very driven to do. But unlike your Knight of Wands energy, they was on the Knight of Wands with the moon, okay? Willing to do something low-balling and treacherous. Very, very driven to do that, to get money, to get this Ace of Cups that they at one point had, Okay? That they may still have, but they ain't going to have it for long with this five of pentacles here. Back out here with the ten of wands. Because, no, back out here with the ten of swords. Because this, this king of pentacles and whoever this devil lover's energy is that he was partnering with, they really tried to come for you because you were really residing in this king and queen of wands energy. Very independent. Very self-confident. Possibly even generous. You've possibly shared your abundance with others. And they're jealous of your ability to do that as well. To take care of and help other people because you got it. Ten of cups with the high priestess. There's definitely a, a Pisces involved here. Five of Swords. So this person was secretly working against you having a bright future. This person was secretly trying to even gather knowledge on you to prove that somehow you were doing something fraudulent. This is crazy. Why are these people Seven of Swords? I'm telling you what I'm picking up on. They, they really went out on the limb here to try to prove that you was getting money in a false way. And that's why that shit didn't came back on them so hard. It's them boomerang right back to this karmic couple. And they really was out here doing something foul with money. For money. To get money. Two of wands. Now they trying to figure out how they going to get through their current debacle. These people may have even done something fraudulently to obtain a home, to purchase a home. Now they're struggling on how they're going to keep that home. It's a queen of cups. I'm telling you, now this queen of cups struggling. They went so hard to cause some sort of financial loss for you. And I'm telling you, these people are struggling to hold on to a home that they fraudulently obtained. Whatever money that they used to get this home, it was through fraud. And they asked Ben 
been discovered, okay? Why they coming for you? That's why they regret everything they said about you because everything they said about you got the justice system halting things in their life. Making decisions about how things should go for them when it comes to how they produce income. Narcos just came on by Migos. And here you are sitting pretty, unencumbered, free from whatever allegations that they try to put on you because the, the court has decided that you're doing the right thing, that you want to open up with this judgment to the Ace of Swords and any attempt to cause issues for you has been blocked. Okay? So, that's that, fire signs. These people can't bother you no more because they got, they, they got bigger fish to fry. They got the, they got the show how they was receiving these offers that they got and they in regret because i'm telling you they're not able to show how they uh, how they legally obtained a lot of these investments that they have incurred they they can't show that nine of swords and i'm gonna leave it here I hope this message helps someone. I hope it gave you insight and guidance on how to move forward. But always remember, if it doesn't apply, please let it fly. Take only what resonates, leave the rest, and I'll be back soon with another one. Peace, y'all.